I am showing you my very abused Pentel water brush from one of my daily sketch kits. I love the Pentel, Pentel water brushes. They're, they are my favorite of all of them. Koi's not bad either, but above all, my favorite is Pentel. I have the least problem with it. It doesn't leak. Uh, comes in a few nib sizes. Anyway, this is the medium, I think. Um, and as you could see from the earlier shot, the bristles are very splayed and abused and frayed. I could just toss it out. I have plenty of these um, in my stash, extra ones, but I tend to be uh, pretty frugal um, when I can. And rather than tossing it out immediately, I usually put them through one or two haircuts uh, before I just decide that they're past it. So here I am with a small pair of scissors, nothing special. As you can see from that shot, these scissors actually have glue stuck to them. Um, these are just from my art table and I have my reading glasses on so I can see what I'm doing and a bright light shining on my desk. And I am giving the splayed bristles a little bit of a haircut and repointing the bristles to something that makes sense and is more useful. I can tell you I have used said brush since I've given it a trim and holy cow, it works much better. So uh, that being said, it worked. Um, I can tell when they need trimming when those bristles are hanging out sideways uh, in a horizontal fashion from the rest of the bristles. Um, they just completely get in my way and that's when I need to just give it a trim and cut them off. So that's what I've done. Um, I hope this gives you some ideas. You can do this on regular paint brushes as well as of course water brushes, but see how you can fix something in your stash before you replace it. Even if the handle is loose from your paintbrush on a regular paintbrush, pull the handle out, shove some epoxy in there, stick the handle back in and let it dry. You'd be surprised what you can do. That's it for today. Have a great day, everybody. Talk to you soon.